Hey, what's Hi, going everybody. on? Hello. What is going down? Look at that. 66 schools with us. Crikey. Yeah, there's what's already some. There? Nicole, what did you do? I don't know what I did. Oops. Um, there's already people Have putting things in. in the local areas. <laughs> yeah, I said, get there, represent us. Come on. <laughs> Knocking door to door. That's what we've been doing. Well, anyway, thank you very much for coming. It's a real pleasure to be here with you. Um, we are live at the moment. And if you do have any comments, like Gene Fields, there they are, representing. Hi, <laughs> hey, everybody. You can stick them in the comments. Hey, you can stick them in the comments and then we can put them on there. Mm -hmm. So keep them encouraging, keep them positive, and just keep them being things that we really want to put on screen. That's the main thing. Oh, somebody's joining in on the action here. Oh, I got you. I see you. I see you all. <laughs> uh, if you do have any snacks, tell us what your snacks are. Nicole, what okay. are your snacks? Um, oh, I've just had my snack. I had a I had a cereal bar. I finished it though, so I can't prove it. Mm, but, um, there you go. And here's last another week one. We had, last week we, what do we have? Um custard creams was a favorite. And bourbon biscuits. I was just massively jealous. Um, Nicole, give a shout out to this school, please. Oh, yeah, here we go. So we've got a uh, hello from everybody in Drum Quinn. That's a local school for us over Drum here. Drum Quinn. That's exactly why I got you to do that one. <laughs> I wasn't sure how to say it. <laughs> well, I'll get you to do this one then. <laughs> oh, man. Clanchisant. 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 That's what I'm going with. I'm, th I'm pretty hey. sure that's the case. The Olchen Varian for coming. Who have we got here? Here we go. Holy, Hello I can do that one. I don't, I don't need a local to do that one. No, that's just down the road you for me. Hello, that. everybody. Oh, yeah. What have we got? They're all coming in. Finland class. They're, they're all the way from Finland. Maybe from Langley Heritage, <laughs> though. Uh, oh, hang on. What have we got? Peninsula East. Look at this oh, one. Yeah, Look at this one, by the way. Ah, Murcia from Spain. I know you guys. Yeah. I know Catherine Saunders very well. What a legend she We're is. We're going global, Perfect Dom. pronunciation. Well done. That's Do you see funny. what they said on the team? Perfect pronunciation. Pronoun da. Pronoun da. Diolchan variaum. Da yaum. Bryn Owl Primary School. Good stuff. We've got Comba Primary School. Uh, yeah. Well, well, well. They're just all coming in. Oh, all oh man. This is your one. Yeah. What's that? Is, is that a Northern Ireland one, is it? That is, yeah. Okay, Hi, guys. Points pass. Wow, that's yeah. a, that's a that's a really unique spelling, isn't it? <laughs> Phonics okay. skills the limit there. <laughs> well, I know exactly. Just hope there's I hope there's no one tuning in from German. My German's pretty bad. Oh, hang on. France class. Someone's saying they're from France. Oh, Langley. Okay. I keep on thinking Finland, France, they're all coming in. There we go. There you go. There's another one for you. Yeah, upper Bally Boy. And also I see we've got Edwards Primary School. I've been in that school. Hello, everybody. Hi, guys. Good to yeah, see you. Yeah. I'm like sure it. there's going to be more coming in, but we better get started. Otherwise, we're not going to have time. Yeah, that is very true. Nicole is the time mistress. She often she often tells me off for going a little bit too far, which is probably what's going to happen today. But anyway, during all that blurb, God, that was four minutes of just total nonsense. Um, we have... We are hoping that you are already into Adobe Express. I'm really hoping yeah. that's the case. Uh, you should hopefully be looking at something a little bit like this. Mm -hmm. If you're on a desktop, a laptop, uh, um, what else do you Chromebooks, there we go. Um, and also, if you're on an iPad, you can be logged into any of the apps. Like, it, Well, actually, what's the first one? They'll need to be logged into the Spark page. Oh, look at that, Miss O'Connor just coming in there. Spark page is the one they're going to be using first, isn't it? Yeah, we've got Spark page, then we've got Spark um, Adobe Express will be the second one we do, and then we go on to Adobe Spark video at the very end. So we do indeed. Yeah, all three of them, you need to log in for the Northern Ireland schools with your at c2ken.net usernames. You've hopefully already done that already, though. C2ken, say it right, C2ken. Yeah. C2ken and Barbie. C2ken. <laughs> yeah, no, it's C2ken. And if you're in Wales, you're doing it through Hub. Uh, we got more. We got more. Oh, it's Mr. D. 
It's Miss Steady. She's always in on the action. She never misses a chance. And Miss Harlow from Cheam Park Farm as well. So good stuff. Okay, so let's get cracking. Let me share my screen. Let me wrestle it back from Nicole. She always wants the attention. Need to take <laughs> it away from her. Uh, let's put this on here. Let's go up to the top. It's the Digital Leaders Challenge. We're going to do this in an hour and a half. If you have to leave a little bit early, I know some schools finish at 2.45. Mind blown. How do you finish so early? Even earlier, some people, I think, don't worry about that. That's absolutely fine. If you do two out of three tasks, we won't chop your heads off. That's absolutely fine. But we're using this Digital Leaders Challenge page as our kind of central hub. Uh, if you can access short links, I know most schools can, but a few schools can't. I have sent the email through to teachers with the link, with the long link. But you can go to Adobe, Adobe even, dot ly forward slash edubullying. Okay. And then you'll find all this information. If you can't access it, honestly, it's absolutely fine. It's just a little handy thing if you can. Uh, and what happens, Miss O'Connor, if they have uh -huh. one of your fancy damn devices? <laughs> so if, if you're using an iPad, all you're going to do is open the camera app, point the camera at the QR code that's on your screen. A little link will pop up. Tap it and go. <laughs> just like that. Oh, hey, Bally Holland School from New York in. Hello, guys. Oh, there you go. Bit late. Bit late. Someone said Roger at primary there. Not happy with that. Not happy at all. <laughs> yeah, we will. Trying to join from Park Primary as well. There we are. Good stuff. Okay. Now, um, if you can't access this page, it's totally fine. Don't worry about it. But if you can, great. So let's have a quick look at what we're going to do today. So first thing we'll do is we're going to uh, watch a quick video because it's what week is it? Come on, Nicole. This is your last it's chance now. Last chance to get it right. It's anti-bullying week, and it's been going on since Monday the 14th, and it'll continue right through to Friday the 18th of November. So you're right in the middle of it right now with us, um, which we're so honoured that you're all here, which is just great. So Dom's going to show a video, and we're going to talk a lot today about how we can put a stop to bullying in schools and embrace the wonderful school communities that you all have. We're, we have no doubt about yeah, that. Yeah, let's, let's keep it positive, Nicole. Let's keep it yeah. positive. Let's make it things about things like being heroes and stuff like that. That's what we're going to do. So let's, the first thing we're going to do is this web design challenge. We're going to create a, going to create a very beautiful um, like web presentation or web page. Mm -hmm. Then we're going to go on to creating a poster. I prefer to call it a graphic because it makes me feel more professional. Um, and yeah, I know. Well, you know, we have to try. We have to keep the illusion alive. And then, um, and then third of third, what are we doing? What's the third thing we're doing, Nicole? Well, the last one's a video. So if we get time to do the video one, um, we will we'll at least start it. We will. Yeah, we'll at least, I'll keep Dom on track. We'll at least get it started. And you can always go back and finish any of these challenges because what we want you to do is we want you to complete at least two of them, send them through to Dom and I. There'll be a little link on because what's going to happen, Dom? What are you going to do? Well, for all those who complete at least two tasks, you'll get swag, merch, oh, yeah. as the young people in our society call it. And if you actually go and teach other people, like the digital leader legend you are, you not only become a digital leader legend, you also become a, Nicole? Swag legend. Yeah, and you get <laughs> VIP swag. <laughs> Check that out. Uh, I'm ordering it right official, now, in fact. My official ask to be a swag legend as well. Um, I would mm, love to be well, a swag legend. We shall see how you get on today, Nicole. We shall okay, see. Okay, I'll have to submit my work as well and see if Dom approves it's, of it. It's not guaranteed, but you can definitely try, like everybody else. <laughs> okay, there's no favoritism here. Even Nicole has to go through the hoops. So let's scroll up here if you've got this page great because you've got little links on there that you can use if you haven't doesn't matter just watch my screen and the first thing we're going to do is design a web page on how to stop bullying in schools and how to be a community legend let's call them that community superhero something like that yeah so community superhero, i like that yeah i like it too so what i've got here is you've got use this writing if needed you can see that little link there you can use that qr code with your fancy dan machine whatever you want to do you do your scanny qr -y thingy uh and if you if you do get access to it it looks a little bit like this if you don't get access to it it's absolutely fine because we're just learning how to build the page and you can 
come up with your own words because there's not many words on here. I'm not. I'm not. I'm a man of few words, as you can see. Look how many people are in the document already. What? 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 Oh yeah. Look at all the anonymous animals at the top. Let's see if there's any on the first row that I can't say. <laughs> oh, what's that? What on earth is that? Oh, a blobfish. I can say a blobfish. There you go. I'll say that. Yeah. Right. Okay. So we're going to use this text here. If you haven't got it, don't worry about it. It's dead easy to do your own. I'm going to teach you how to put together a web page or web presentation. So what will happen is I'll go first, do a, do, do a little bit of it, just get the start going, and then I'll throw it over. <laughs> well done. We didn't even practice that. And you, did we you see how good it was? Like it. We're going to <laughs> keep it forever now. <laughs> yeah, that, was, that was so fresh. And and then Nicole's going to do it on like an iPad. Now, you can work alongside at the same, you know, alongside us, alongside us, not like right here, but like, you know, you can work at the same time of us synchronously. Uh, or yeah. you can kind of wait, see how it goes and then jump in when you feel ready. doesn't matter either way. But we will be demoing and then we will be giving you some time. And one thing that I would say is don't worry if you don't finish it all. It's absolutely fine. No one is going to take your packed lunch from you. Nope, that's not going to happen. And that's not, especially not Nancy Bullion Week. No, absolutely not. Yeah. It's all about teaching yeah. you the skills. So the writing and the text isn't the most important part. That's why Dom's given us the answers already. Ka ching. Mm -hmm. So we're just <laughs> practicing the skills, copy and paste, just to get used to all of the creative tools we've got here. Yeah. So actually, talking of copy and pasting, I'll put my skills to good use and copy that. And then I'm going to go back to Adobe Express. And this is how you start your page, right? So press the plus, go down to web page. It loads up. Da, 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 da. Add your title. I copied them. I copied it. So I'm now mm -hmm. pasting it. Yes. Add a subtitle. Dom, a.k.a. also known as Swag Legend Provider. No, that doesn't <laughs> make any sense. Swag Legend um, Creator. I create oh. Swag Legends. There we go. And then I'm going to put a background photo in because if there's one thing that keeps me up at night, it is those gray screens. Ugh, we don't like looking at them. The amount of times that my stomach has done a 360 every time I see one of those gray backgrounds. If I had a pound for every time <laughs> someone sent me a gray background, I'd be a very moderately rich man. So, uh, <laughs> To put a, put a photo in the background, you can press, you can click anywhere in that gray section, actually. And then you could do something like, how can we stop bullying in schools? Well, I'm going to go on a really positive theme because I was told by someone really clever that actually we should be doing things in a more positive way. So yeah. let's do, let's look for a really cool one. Oh, where did they find this photo? This is me. That was just last week, wasn't it? I know. Was, you and your holidays. <laughs> <laughs> I know. That's incredible. And I'm just moving the title up to the top right there. So there we go. There's a picture of me. How can we stop put put a stop to bullying in schools? Apart from me being the cape, the caped anti-bullying crusader, uh, we can also use that one. There's different ways to do it. You can just click the button again. You can press replace, for example. You can upload a photo if you've got one on your machine. You can connect it to Google Drive if you've got stuff on there. Whatever you want to do, that easy to do. Right. Nicole O'Connor, are can you ready? Yeah. Oh, right. Go Carrying on. on. Right. Hey. All right. Just, just when she caught it. Right. Off you go. <laughs> all righty. So for all of my iPad friends, we're going to go to Spark page. Uh, again, you're going to open up with all of this inspiration and templates that you could start um, working off. But I'm just going to go and create my own one because we're all the digital leaders here. We're creative. We've got it all up here and we've got it all at our fingertips. So first of all, I see the gray screen. Bear with me, Dom, for just a wee second. <laughs> Hang in there. So <laughs> what I need to do is I need to go and copy and paste my text. So what I can do is I'm just swiping up from the bottom of my screen. And I see the docs button. Ooh, I went out of it. I see the docs button and I'm just going to bring it up and drop it in front here. So that's that's my so screen. Fancy. I know so it's my split fancy. screen feature that I'm able to do. Depending on what age your iPad is and what software you have, you may or may not be able to do that. But either way, just go into your document, hold down on a word and you get these little blue dots that you can then drag over 
to copy. And then all I have to do is I can swipe that away for now. I don't want it. I just want to go tap and paste. So I've got my title in. And I give my subtitle my name as well. Nicole, a.k.a. <laughs> swag. <laughs> I'm going to wait and see what you come up with there. What are you going to come up with? <laughs> swag wisher. <laughs> 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 oh, so, from here then I just tap on the grey and I'm going to go to photo and you'll see the options I've got here so if I've got a photo on my iPad I can just upload it or what I really like is that you can just take a picture there and then so if you and your do classmates it, want it, to do, do it, do like it. free games or a little tableau, a little bit of drama like act it out, act out a scene you just snap a picture of it and put it straight in here. Or you can go to find free images, which is what I'm going to do for now. So I'm going to go search for an image. And hmm, I'm going to go down the hero route too. I might have to do um, Wonder Woman. Let's, oh, let's see. Uh-huh, uh-huh. I'm getting too many. Uh -huh. just so let me try Super Hero. Yeah, no, I'm not the ones I'm looking for. So what I love about this is because whenever you're making your own web pages, is there's this thing called search engine optimization. So it's a fancy SEO where you have to use lots of keywords and think of lots of different types of words to find the image that you're looking for. And that's what we're doing here. So heroes. Let's see what I'm getting. Oh, there's Spidey Man. Hello. <laughs> Spidey. Spidey Spidey Man. Spidey Man. Uh-huh. Okay. Do you I know like what it. I'm going to do? I'm going to choose this one for now, but I'm going to change that while Storm takes it back and continues yeah. on. No problem at all. So let me get it back here. So uh, I've done my title. Dead easy. Like I said before, follow along. Uh, you know, do the bits that you can while you're here. That's absolutely fine. I don't feel under pressure to go too fast or keep up or whatever. Just do bits and just watch. And so I'm going to copy and paste my first question and answer. So the first question was, what is bullying in school? So let's define it. Uh, and I've got the picture of me there in the center on my holidays last week in an abandoned <laughs> building with bizarrely posh spotlights. And then I'm going to go down here. I'm going to go to, it just says scroll, start writing your story. You see that? Pops up. And it's gone away. Mm -hmm. Pops up. Gone away. Uh so I'm going to go to split layout because I have made thousands, if not tens of thousands of these pages. And this is a way that I think makes them look really nice. So I'm just going to click. Did you see what I did there? Just click the plus, go to text. I've copied and now I will paste my text. And then what I'm going to do here, you see, this is the thing about sort of design layout. Okay. One of the things about design layout is that you really should be distinguishing the questions from the answers quite important that. Uh, because it's easier on the eye if the reader can see oh yeah the formatting of the questions is always the same and it's always different from the answers so i'm gonna go i could go to header one that's quite big a bit too big i think header two mm, don't mind that the quote function hello that looks pretty pro i like it a lot yeah nicole likes it as well so it must be good Right, and so what I'm going to do there is I'm going to get a keyword from my text. And on the left-hand side, I'm going to add an image. Now, rather than superhero, let's get gritty. Uh, let's get right into the heart of the action here. Yeah, I'm sure we've all experienced a bit of this, and I'm sure ne none of us actually liked it. So let's put one of those in there. And one of the things you can do with this is you can click the photo, and you can find like a different focal point, for example. So if you wanted to make sure if something if you put a photo in and you and it was kind of missing bits, like it was chopping off people's heads, not literally, but you know, uh, or it was, you know, you wanted it to focus on a different place, just drag that little circle to a different place, click save. There you go. Maybe I've gone a bit too far though, so I can just go back, move it to there, click save. Yeah, perfect. That's slap bang where I want it to be. That's great. So um that's my first section done. Nicole, ready? Yeah, let's go. Okay. Let's oh. Yeah. Check Someone that out. Busy. <laughs> I look really professional already. So 
I went I went and found that image elsewhere. I just searched superhero background um, and I went and found that, saved it to nice. my iPad and then I replaced. So if you just tap on your background, say you don't like it, just tap that replace button and you can drop in another photo. So I could go and drop in this one. That's a wee bit too busy. I actually quite like this as my starting point. So I'm going to go there. Again, you can kind of see it at the bottom here. Scroll to start writing your story. So I'm going to scroll down. And I'm also a pretty big fan of split layout. So that's where I'm going to start from. You'll see you've got the button in the middle to switch it around. And you can put your image over here and your image over there. So I'm going to put, put in one now. Let's see. And oh, I quite like that. But again, I have the same problem that's that Dom good. talked about where it cuts off stuff. So I'm going to yeah. tap and change the focal point and I want over here and I see a little preview at the side calling all superheroes nice. there we go now you know what? I can even change it more see how that works yeah love it okay so I've got it I need to go back into my text on bullying I need to copy it drag in the little blue dots Go back in here, tap text, and then tap the empty space and tap paste. And again, I love, 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 love that it separates the question from the answer so that we can do the fancy formatting. So it's only very slightly different to the one that Dom showed you where all of my features on the iPad are at the top here. So I've got header one. Whoa, it's massive. I've got header yeah. two. And then I've got quote. Okay, yeah, that gives me enough of a difference that it doesn't, it would fit quite nicely with my theme here, which I quite like. Yeah. I can also go over, I like centering things sometimes. So I could maybe tap my answer here and center it. Oh, yes. Very nice. I like it. Cool. I like it. Right. Let me rest it back. Where am I? There it. I am. Cool. So uh, I'm going to go on to my second section here. Again, if you haven't got access to this text, it's absolutely fine. Just, just um, make it up. It's absolutely fine. We're just learning how to build the page. Uh, so I'm going to scroll down again. I'm going to do a split layout again. And what, watch what happens when you put your second split layout in. The photo now goes onto the opposite side. Now, you can just switch them about really easily if you want to. Dead easy. Mm -hmm. uh, but actually, I'm going to, I will do that thing where it has image on the left first, image on the right second. Go over here, press text, copy it in like we did first time. Keep the formatting of the questions consistent. That is a top design tip. And then on the right hand side, uh, I mean, I could just choose um, I could just choose another bullying photo, but I could choose something like afraid. Oh, I should spell it right, and then it it would make a world of difference, wouldn't it? Um, and then something like oh, this one that's quite hard hitting. Uh, and one of the things that I wanted to show you as well is um, you can put buttons in. So things like I've got here the National Bullying Helpline contact numbers in there as well. I'm going to copy the URL to that page just in case anybody needs it. And then I'm going to press the plus, go to button, and then it says, well, button text, like uh, National uh, Bullying Helpline, for example, put that in there. And then I'll put the URL that I copied. So if anyone needs to know how to contact someone to speak to someone, if they don't have someone, uh, close by that they can talk to, and that's a really good way to do it. So there you go. That's how you put in a button. Um, Nicole? Yeah, let's go. Ready? Cool. Yeah. Right, let's, uh, let's put that one on. There we go. So I have already went and copied my text. So now when I go in and choose split layout, as Dom says, it flips it over. So it does that for us iPad users as well. And I can paste in my text now. Again, big fan of consistency. We want it to look mm -hmm. the same. I also need to center my answer down here. And I'm going to pop in an image too. I love this one. Hey, come on. Hey, love loving this that. Um, oh, it's got a warning. Low resolution. Okay, I hear you. I'm going to replace it then. I'll choose Perfect. this one. Oh, or this one actually. I've got a few different options I could choose. So from here, what I could do is also add in a button. So if I just tap my plus underneath here, I can insert a button. I might go and look for 
something. There's Childline from NSPCC. Yeah. That's I really could good one. just tap the URL bar at the top to copy it. And now I'm popping back into my page. I'm going to paste that down here where it says HTTP and then say Childline. And yeah. Again, the options, you can have the button way over on the left. You can have it centered or on the right. I also like it centered, so it's just going to sit right in there. There we go. Cool. Looking good. Very nice. Okay, so uh, sections three and four, which are our last two sections. I'm going to do these kind of all in – well, what I'm going to do here, let me just show you, is I need to go to my page. And rather than do another split layout, we've done enough of those. I'm going to press the plus here and we'll go to Glide Show. Now it says add a few background photos to Glide Show. So what I want is I want a image, I want an image for my section three and I want an image for my section four. Okay. So the first one is um, you know, talk to an adult at your school. So maybe if you can, I mean, maybe I'll go to something like Hero again, for example, and see if there's someone, if there's something we can see. There we go. I think that one's pretty good. A uh, young person or a, an older person helping out a younger person. That looks pretty good. So find yourself a hero to talk to. And then the last one, probably kindness, something like that. So let me go over here. Kindness. Do you know, Nicole, way back mm -hmm. when you found one of a young person fishing <laughs> and it was really <laughs> cool and I just can never, ever find it ever again. Oh, what was uh, my word? that who maybe knows it was it kind was it just kind on its own maybe it was just kind mm. Let's have a look. do you know what this one's pretty good kind words cost nothing because that's what it's all about really yeah. uh now when I, now i've got my section three photo and section four photo i'm gonna click save in the top right you can see it in the top right click save cool oh, now wow. i can move these text boxes that's nice isn't it it looks good that's powerful yeah it's good and then i've got my section three paste in here dead easy uh yeah so keep the consistency like nicole was saying and uh, do you know what i'll just keep this really quick because I'll, and then i'll let nicole go and then i'm going to show you to put a video in afterwards and then kind words cost nothing how can you stop bullying all together in your school stick it in there change the formatting keep the formatting consistent all the time i'm not going to move the box there because i want to see this kind words cost nothing and i'm going to keep and the coffee cup is kind of don't really need that so um mm. i'll just keep it on the left hand side there uh right nicole glide show over to you yeah let's go so again swipe down a little bit and you'll get the options here's my glide show and it brings me straight to photos so i can tap some of the ones that i have already and I can also go back and search for free images. So if you're finding like you want to search for a word and you're using an iPad, and you're maybe not sure how to spell it. You have the dictation tool right beside your space bar here. So I could tap type here. Let me see what I'm going to say. I'm going to say super quote. Because I'm quite a fan of Dom's quote and I'm going to see if there's one maybe. Mm, no, there's no results there for me, unfortunately. So you can search for things there if you're not sure about the spelling. You can also do that if you're using read and write on your desktop. Uh, let's search for um, friends. And we get some lovely images. Oh, that one's cute. Nice hug. Um, oh, that is nice. That is, yeah. So there's so many that you could choose from. I'm going to pop that one in. And I'm going to pop that one in. Just I'm going crazy now putting in those. I'm going to tap, tap done because I don't need that many. Um, and again, here's my little grey box that I'm going to put my text into. <laughs> Love <laughs> so your background. It's just great. So I'm going to hold down here. Copy. Again, if you can't access this text, it doesn't matter. It just puts something in that space there to practice using the skills. And now I'm going to paste. There we go. So Good this stuff. is a quote. There we go. Um, for the people using iPads who want to pop in a video. So, for example, I've just gone to YouTube and it was Odd Socks Day on Monday. So Andy and the Odd Socks have you their... You love Andy and the Odd Socks. I'm a big fan, big fan. So they have their new song for this year's theme. And I'm just going to tap, I tap the share button, then tap copy link. 
And when I go back into my presentation, I can tap plus and then add a video. And all you have to do is paste in your link that you've recently copied and voila, it pops in there. So, Jealous. Hey, hey, no, you're not. You can do it too. Go. <laughs> okay, right. So I've got a video here too. It's about what is bullying. It's a nice little animation. So I'm going to copy the link to that video. And then I'm going to put it into my first section because I want to be different from Nicole. Mm. Uh, and I'm going to press the plus just underneath the text here. You can see you can put it on top if you want. You can put it on underneath. I'm going to put mine underneath. And then I'm just going to paste in my YouTube link. Boom, there it is. Right. Uh, what I'm going to do now is just show you. But if you go up to the top and press present, you can scroll through your page. You can do the same on the iPad as well. It looks very, very similar. It's a little play button at the top. Uh, how can we put a stop to bullying in schools? I can use my left and right arrows to scroll through. Nice. There's my video. I can click my video. It will play if I press in the middle there. Don't have to leave the page, which is really nice. Section two, I've got my button in there. If I click that, it will take me through to the National Bullying Helpline. And then we've got section three. Did you see what it did there? Look at this. Oh, very nice. Oh, the way it does that. Love it, love it, love it. Slide <laughs> show in action. <laughs> <laughs> Come out of that. Press share. Publish and share link. Create a link. You can save it. You can send it to things like Google Classrooms. You can Google Classroom. And you can send it to stuff like uh, Microsoft Teams. Or you can grab this link, for example, and you can. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah. <laughs> you can copy it. And then if you've managed, let me get my banner. Share your work. There's a banner on the bottom. Hey, Ooh. there it is. Bit.ly forward slash share express. If I click on that link here, it's going to take me through to a form. You, just, you, can, you can send it to us if you want. You don't have to. If you don't want to, that's absolutely fine. But you can put your first name or nickname. Ask your teacher. Should we use our real name? Should we not? That's absolutely fine. Don't mind either way. Or don't put anything in at all. Put your school in or just put your link in. So I'll put like uh, DT. That's my nickname. Uh, your school, Adobe School of... Swag, swag and then <laughs> swag school and then i can press submit and then it will we'll, we'll get to see some of them so that's cool uh nicole give them a quick whiz on that yeah so for my ipad friends we're going to go to the top you can go to the play button here and you will get to preview your website page in action which i think is fab and if we're ready and you want to share it because it's really good that you've done all this work on your ipad but you need to go further. We need to exhibit it and share it with the world. So as Dom said, we can share this to Google Classroom, Teams, Seesaw, Class Dojo, or put it straight onto your school website, wherever. Just get it off the device and share it with everybody. And here we go. We've got the share icon here. Uh, you can type in some of these um, details if you want. You'll see the little blue icon is highlighted for me. That's the clipboard. So it's going to copy my create a public link. And it's going to copy that to the clipboard so that I can go and paste that link into bit.ly forward slash share express. And if you do that, then Dom and I might be able to pop some of them onto the screen. the screen for everybody to see. Yeah. Right. What I'm going to do is I'm going to give you about five minutes. Does that sound all right? Yeah. I think we're a bit behind time today, Time Lord. <laughs> uh, a wee touch but we're okay a wee touch a wee it's touch, because there's so say. many people here we, we give so many shout outs at the start that's why <laughs> that's true all right well we'll do a quick well, let's say four minutes doesn't matter if you don't finish it's absolutely fine don't think you have to complete you don't gonna give you four minutes to ha just have a little go you, you've probably been having a go already which is great um yeah. that's probably the best way to do is to, is to um, listen what you know listen and do things at the same time you got four minutes and then we'll show a few and then we'll move on. Okay, so let me put some music on. It's feeding the Ducks music? It's Feeding the Ducks. Yeah. That's what this music's called. That's working music. <laughs> yeah. Whoa, we've got loads coming in. Tell you what I'll do is I'll put some on the screen As while we go. we're waiting. That'd be good, wouldn't it? Yeah, that'd be okay. good. Okay. <laughs> 
right let me come back here look at all of these coming through so this was the one that i put on before highlighted it just to make sure that um we knew where the new ones were coming in alfred high school just just crushing it let's have a team feel that we've got going on here pretty Ooh. oh yeah Oh, I like that. The photo in the middle of it. Very nice. Good, consistent design. I like it. You see, didn't complete at all. That's absolutely fine. Sent it in anyway. That's what I like. Reese. Reese Santos. What a strong name that is. Yeah. Hang on a minute. Look at this. Your brother? <laughs> yeah, it is. Same weekend. <laughs> Who knew? Oh dear. Three sentence. Love that. I hope that's a, like a Welsh Spanish hybrid. That's just such a cool one. Uh, Daniel. Okay. Video nice. Oh, nice. Like that as well. This is good, isn't it? Good, consistent formatted. Like oh yeah, a lot. big title. Let's keep them coming. God, look at them all flooding in. Okay, Philip, nice. Ooh, hard hitting photo, literally. Good yeah. stuff. Fun intended. Like this. Where did he find that image? Wow, what did you search for, Philip? Tell me immediately. I want to know. <laughs> Stick it in the comments. What did you search for? Because I need that photo in my life. Great stuff. You've got that as well. Loving it. Ooh, copycat. That's fun. Copycat. Nice. Hey. Is this yours? Hey. <laughs> What's going on? What's going on? Okay. Oh, I like this photo a lot. Do you know, I think I might have put this text up in the top left, actually. And then it would have been like the... Yeah, but it's still amazing photo, Aiden. Good stuff. See that the formatting's very clean. Great oh, yeah. stuff. That's, that's a good photo. What did you search for there? I mean... Oh, no! It's the same but different. Yeah, it's the same image. It's exciting. Yeah. Uh, okay, this one here, I can't open that because why can't I open? Oh, hang on, I can do this. You wait around. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, I can do this. There we go. Nice. Very nice photo. Very cool. Reach out. Anti-Bullying Alliance. Good link. Well done. Okay. Team Fields. Team Fields. I can't open that one because it is, um, it's not your share link. You've just taken it from the browser. So rather than publishing and sharing your link, you've taken it out of the top here. And actually no one can see that link apart from you. So have yeah. a little check. Right. I know that I'm going to skip over a load of Elford High School ones here. And I am sorry about that. But let's try and... Uh, represent other schools here. Ah, this is from Miss Sturdy's class and Freya. Where'd you get that from? Nice. Bet she just made it like in two minutes because she just is oh, yeah, just a legend. Oh yeah, this is very artsy. Isn't this nice? Yeah. What is going on here? I like this. It's a different layout as well. I really like it. What did, where did you get these photos from? Are they design assets? Oh, what, are what are they? And you got a video. And you got a button. Cracking work, Freya. Right, another team feels that has the link from the browser rather than the published one. Belgrave. I know these guys. I know these guys. Elisa, what is bullying? Very nice. She's used a different style here. Oh, yeah. yeah, good stuff. She's used her own text as well. This is great. I love the way she's done this. Well done. Love it. Make a speech. Yeah. 
And just remember, treat people the way you want to be treated. Talk to people the way you want to be talked to. Respect is earned, not given. I like it. I love that. Yeah, very good stuff. Oh, here's a cheating one we can open. Yes. Good. Video. Button. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Nice. People are asking how do they share their work with us? Do you see the banner at the bottom of the screen? It says bit.ly forward slash share express. If you type that link in, it'll open up on your web browser. All you need to do is publish your web pages link and paste it in there. So that's yeah. be for everybody. You're not sending it to us on YouTube, you're sending it to us on bit.ly forward slash share express. Exactly that. Right, let me just do a let's do a uh Bryn Arwen. Bryn Arwen, one sorry. Let's have a look. Nice, Myron Ava. Good stuff. Nice. Hey, I've been listening. I like it when people listen. St. Joseph, let's represent St. Joseph's. We're gonna move on very shortly. Yeah, all our good stuff. Oh, I like it. You've done why me. These dogs are vicious. No, oh, let's Somebody's told you how to find that stunning image. Just by searching oh, here, you're going to have, have to scroll. Took... What? Oh, they, they, they've gone on a scroll. They've, yeah. gone, they've gone for a stroll, a scroll. Fair play. <laughs> oh, I can't open that one because it um, isn't your publishing share link. Um, there's, an, there's a Langley Heritage one that is. Ooh. Oh, nice. Ooh. Pretty cool. They've gone spacey on us. Yeah, I like that. And Good thing. There's a holy yeah. trinity here. We are gonna move really quickly off this now. Hey. Oh, no. <laughs> He's safety so. Go on, Connor. <laughs> nice going. This is class. Reach out, be kind. I like it. I like Mighty it a lot. Very well done. Yeah, I like it a lot. Right. Let's get this feed the ducks off. Uh, let's move on now. I know loads of people have submitted. I, you know, I really would love to stay here and just do all of them all day, but we do have to move on into our second challenge because time is of the essence and yes, we must go. complete our challenges. So, uh, challenge number two, don't worry if you haven't finished the first challenge, not about finishing today. It's about getting in all the knowledge <laughs> like that. So, Challenge two, graphic design. Create a poster to highlight anti-bullying week and your commitment to end bullying. So there's yes. a template there if you need it. Don't really need it. It's fine. I'm gonna, do you know what? I'll take on the challenge of doing without it. But if you want to use it, go for it. So let me come out of that. Let me go to my home page. So many pages. Get rid of more of my pages. Oh, there we are. Look at that. Uh, come on. Let's get this going. Okay, cool. So, uh, search all templates. What am I going to search for? Well, I could search for poster. You'll get just, I mean, just so many different things for poster. But I'm actually going to search for bullying instead. Uh, because actually, there's loads of stuff here that you can just start, you know, tweaking and I, I like this one. This one's a good one. This don't be a bully. That's a good one. I like this one. That's about positivity. And so what we're going to be doing here is just showing you how to um, how to just change things slightly, how to manipulate images, how to change text and stuff like that. So I'm going to click on that one. You can click on any one you like, or you can click on the template, which is on that page link there. Um, but otherwise, just choose, just put bullying in and see what you get. So um what have we got here we've got a background which is purple Whoa, don't want to do purple i would love to make it more vomity green where's vomity <laughs> they're not very vomity is it there you go that's more vomity yeah maybe we should do it like that or maybe we shouldn't do it like that at all you just change things by selecting them just click anywhere and you'll you click on the thing you want to change and change it so here i could go back to change the color again or i could choose an image which is what I'm going to do. And I'm going to go over to Hero. And I wonder, there it is. It's right there. Ah! Right, <gasps> put it in. Well, this doesn't look very good, does it? Mm, you're going to have to do something. 
you're gonna have to do something here and what i can do is because the actual the part of the image i want is kind of off camera there off camera that way maybe uh <laughs> what i'm gonna do is just click and drag so that could be like bully city yes, and we're gonna yes. stand up against bully let me just zoom in ever so slightly you can see i'm using this bit over here to zoom in which means i can bring my superhero mm -hmm. up a little bit because i want to get it away from that text down there so obviously this pink text isn't really working for me now no. because things have changed i mean i could actually put a filter on i could darken it up the duo tone is quite cool i do like duo mm. tone uh Ooh. Mm, yeah yeah pretty good like in all of these maybe i'll do mm. the orange one, or maybe no do you know what i'm not going to do a filter like that at all i'm going to turn the filter off because what i'm going to do instead is i'm going to change the color of the text so we've got a main style which is the pink and then we've got a highlight style which is the white uh, the white kind of works. Let me see if I can change the black. Yeah, well, it's actually not a black, is it? It's like a dark purple, I think. Uh, if I say, take this um, little color thing right down to the corner, bottom left corner, then it will be completely black. And then this one, the pink one. Oops, see what I did there? If you click on those words, it changes it to the highlight because I've got highlight selected there. I'm going to go to main style, and that's the pink one. Uh, okay. Nicole O'Connor, give me a colour. What colour should it be immediately? Blue. Blue. Incorrect. Uh, <laughs> gonna, because I've just realised what we can do is... Red yeah, for superheroes. Let's do, let's do that. Because we can get the eyes. I see off red. I see a little bit of red on the cape still, so let's do red. Yeah, she's always one step ahead, this lady. So let me go over here. and you. I'm going to find the readiest red on the cape. Click it. Ooh nice and then you know this um icon thing well i could replace it it's actually a shape it used to be called icons now they're called shapes um this one actually is a shape for bullying but actually i don't think i want it at all i actually don't think i want it at all so i'm just gonna click delete get rid of it and then for my text down here what i think i'll do is i'll change it to um join our uh anti-bullying challenge or maybe take on take mm. on our anti-bullying challenge that's kind of nice quite like that let me move it right down you see the way if i'm moving it it gives me the dotted lines to say keep it aligned on the left hand side please that's what you need to do keep it aligned on the left hand side please and then maybe i'll stretch it so it goes on to two like nah rubbish idea uh, i'm going to keep it there i'm going to change it to white because that's a little bit more impactful i like it and one of the things i could do here is i could go to our page that we've got here and maybe i'm going to save this qr code image uh and then i'll put it as uh i'll just put qr code put it in my downloads save mm -hmm. Go back to my page. And actually, we see it's that it's actually just there. I can just click and drag it in. Oh, nice. Yeah. And then if other people want to take on the challenge as well, they can do it there. If I didn't want to, if I didn't have the ability to click and drag it in, I could just go to photos, upload a photo, QR code right at the top there. Look at me being all efficient. Stick it in there, resize it, bring it right down, uh, put it in the corner. And then just go until it kind of aligns with the images there. There you go. That I like that. Best. Yeah. So if you're a laptopy, desktopy person y kind of thing, uh, go for it. Um, and then if you're an iPad y person y thingy, then you're going to watch Nicole smash it. You ready, Nicole? Yeah. iPad y person y thingy. Hello. Welcome. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. it's for a design on so again as dom said you could just tap up here you'll see some of the words that i've searched before to try and find a template but also along the top here you'll see that we have lots of different types that we could choose from and i just saw posters there so i'm just going to tap in to make a poster i'm just going to go completely from scratch with this one so no letting it letting it buffer oh. letting it hmm. Well, doing that to me. Don't worry, there you go. 
Yeah, it'll come. Do you know what? It's probably because we're live streaming at the exact same time. I know, with all sorts of devices on here. I mean, it is very similar, isn't it, on the iPad? Um, oh, it really is, especially so... because we're in the Adobe Express app. So we're not yes. in one of the Spark apps. We're in the Adobe Express app. So therefore, it's even more similar to everything that Dom did there. Hmm. Yeah, maybe well, I'll just gonna... uh, maybe I'll take it back and and do something else on here. Yeah. Yeah. No, I'm gonna swipe then... out, swipe back in. That's what I'm gonna. Yeah. Do. Just give me a nod if you uh, if you're ready. Okay. So um, I've got mine here. Right. Let me show you how to. Let me just pick another template. Uh, if you're doing it on the um, if you're doing it on the iPad, just you'll you'll be able to navigate around and just find what it is. So let me go to uh, this one looks good. Let, let me do this. Okay, so having a tough time. I kind of like that. I like that as a theme. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go over here, and I'm going to. I'm going to change this photo now. I wonder if I just if I press replace here, what have we got? So let me go here and say, uh, let me put something like superhero in again. Okay, oh, I need an update. That's what it is. So I'm just doing oh, okay. that's cool. and I'll be back. Hey, look at this! Boom! Right, having a tough time, and I've got this dude in here now. Let me bring him up. Now, what I suspect with this, with the photo that I replaced it with, was that they had used the crop and shape it because, mm. yeah, they had used the crop and shape. So maybe, if, can I scroll up further? Yes, I can scroll up further. Uh, can I scroll down any further? Maybe not. Okay, so I'm going to say, okay, that's all good. And then I can keep dragging it up. So let me put it up to the top. Let's crop and shape again. Do, can I pull it down? No, I can't pull it down any further. Okay, fine. So here we've got our dude. Um, now, the only problem with this is that he's blocking all the text. Get out of the way. But what you can do is you can either drag the man down in your layer stack here. You can either adjust the order in the layer order here, which is, and it, on the iPad, you'll be able to scroll across at the bottom, and it's got like things like edit, adjust, order, things like that. But I'm just going to take my text, and you see, you're going to move it up the stack, and then it pops out on top. Having a tough time now for my background. It's got a black background here. Now, if I I'm going to choose a different color, and what I'm going to do is like I did on the last one. Uh, instead of the black background, I select my eyedropper. I want it to be exactly the same blue here. There we go. Nice. Ooh. We've got a photo and a background. They're all doing the same sort of thing. Now this text. Not really feeling it because mm -hmm. the it's just not the right it's just not the right color it's just being lost so again use my eyedropper thing having a tough time oh, yeah. uh, okay i like it uh and then and then what will i do here maybe i'll get something like a shape um and i will yeah, it's a, proven a little bit tricky to get shapes up today for some reason. Mm. Uh, what if I put um, speech bubble in here? I wonder what I'll get. What will I get? Okay, nice. So what I might do here is just grab this one. Okay. Now I'm going to flip it. Am I going to flip it? Yeah, I'm going to flip it by selecting it. Flip it here. Okay, and then maybe I'll put it like there, and then you're like, "That looks rubbish. Why are you even doing that?" <laughs> just wait, just just wait. Because I'm gonna press remove background. Dun, da, 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 da. Come on, don't let me down here. Yeah, look at that, perfect speech bubble, nice. And then um, and then maybe I'll bring it down, and then I can put some text in. This is dead easy. Oh, and then, you should definitely put in the words reach out because that's this year's theme. Oh, good one. Uh, right, so double click to edit. So reach out yes. um, to an adult. Oh, yeah. An adult you trust. Let's put that one. An adult you trust. That's a good one. Mm -hmm. Now, not happy with the font in the slightest. 
let me just reduce the size of this let me bring it up to my speech bubble let me rotate it a little bit that looks to be just there perfect you see it actually gave me this sort of that's the same angle as your speech bubble and then i can make that a bit bigger there we go i can see a squirrel munching his way through my lawn right now <laughs> so, let me get back to my work and then you know i'm not happy with the um fonts there so i'm just going to go explore more fonts and then choose one that i do like because i don't think the two fonts should be the same sometimes they should but i don't think they should mm. so uh oh that was pretty cool yeah nice i'm a fan uh okay there we go reach out to an adult you can trust having a tough time that looks good to me let me just put a little let me put a little shape around it no let me put a shadow around it yes I like it that gray the same as the gray from the text as well there we go having yeah. a tough time reach out to an adult you trust nicely done okay so, now I'm do you want ready. to show how to share nicole yeah bring it back over so um, I got in there, just my app needed an update. So um, cool. I found an image and I'm, I mean, I like it. I really like it, but I don't like that somebody's pulling somebody else up. I want it to be like, ooh. Like oh. Well, I like that one. Very nice. Again. Yeah. Um, oh, I get to use my very fancy technical term here. I want to change the color of this. So I've selected the oh, text. Yeah. I'm going to be, I don't want to change the color. I tap here and I get to the scrolly wheel of colors. <laughs> the scrolly wheel of colors. You always need the scrolly wheel of colors. Yeah, so I'll make it red as well because it'll match the cape. And oh, no, I didn't mean to do that. I was selecting a color accidentally. There we go. Tap done. Nice. So you don't you do not do what I just did. And I can resize a little bit. Um, yeah, looking good. I probably need to put the date on there and something else, but... If you're using an iPad, you have two options for sharing your work here. You can you tap do. the download do. button here. So that will just save it straight to your camera roll and your device. Or you can tap the export share button and it will give you, again, you can say you can just save it or you might be able to, there we go, copy a link. Ta -da. Nice. So you're going to copy the link and I wonder where you're going to put that link. You're going to go to oh. bit ly forward slash share express and share it to dom and i so that we can put some of them up on screen <laughs> talking of which there are loads holy trinity have just been on fire what is Woo! going on Way to go, guys Way to I go. Know. there's all sorts on here let me try and get loads of them up okay i actually don't feel like we probably need to give people loads of time so what i'll do is i'll stick some music on um have you shared do you want to share share have you have you already shared shared my work yeah, yeah. I didn't, have you oh, shown yes. people how to share sorry i was looking at the spreadsheet yes i did yes so i said cool. tap the That's share right. button in the top right hand corner go and find copy link cool <laughs> i got it. right I thought, I thought i had a chance <laughs> here to submit my own work i was like what i can get the swag <laughs> i got really excited no Bad not one. today o'connor <laughs> <laughs> um right let me get some of these up i've got i've just got loads up here so while um while miss o'connor whoa some of these are mega some of these are full-on mega right let me just get a few up that one didn't work someone's got a um oh wow these are just these are megs right let me just let me show some of these right i'm gonna take it off you cool. okay we've got four types of bullying look what someone's wow. done here that's pretty cool isn't it be a bully not be a buddy not a bully and it's like even that. got animation this is what i love about digital leaders they're not afraid to hit buttons they will go in and try things that we didn't even show look wow. at that duo Dog. tone good in a filter yeah me in a filter <laughs> Uh, what more could you ask for? Uh, what's going on here? Let me. Oh, couldn't work out that one. Uh, love it. Really Ooh. cool. Your palm tree. Maybe stick it behind the app. But love that a lot. Mm. 
Um, that's a page by Alec. Well done. That's same. I couldn't work out that one. Nice one. Got some icons in there. Don't you bully either. Good stuff. That's from Dara. Okay. Good stuff. Yeah. Lots of use of different images and text and things like that. Well done, Very Lucy. nice. Reach out. Yeah. Nice one, Austin. I love that you put the theme at the very top. Yeah, he did good there. Uh, I like that one. That's another good one. Reach out. They were they were listening. They were actually they were. listening. They were. I love it. Okay, there's another good one there. Yeah. All the That's off to cyberbullying. Reach out. Nice little border the way they've done that. Well done, Connor. Yeah, nice one. Hey! <laughs> bullies. That's what, I mean, that's where bullies belong. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I, to be honest, I wouldn't even give him a Santa hat. I thought that was quite generous. <laughs> there we go. Very oh, good. Yeah. To always take screenshots not. first. That's a good bit of advice for cyberbullying, isn't it? Well done, Yumi. Good, good, good advice. Yeah. Let's get some more out here. Uh, let's get some more going. That one from uh, Broughton Primary. Can't do that because it's your one from your browser. Let's oh, just yeah, skip that one for that. now. Okay. It's a race to try and... Oh, blimey. This is just never... It's a oh, never-ending race <laughs> to try and get stuff out there. There's some Joseph we... jump in, get one of them up at the very bottom. St. Joseph's, there yeah, we go. Yeah, hey, bottom. nice. Hey. We've got Cumber as well. Yeah, fab. Nice going, guys. Yeah. Right, let's go to Sharp. Ooh. Uh, let's go with you know, Lancha Sands as well. <laughs> Ooh, nice. Another one. Another one from Lancha Sands that we can't open. There's another St. Joseph's. I'll get an Alfred up here as well. Uh, and another one there. And then we can go through a whole load of... Blimey, I've got so many. Right, buddy, not a bully. Like that. Very nice. Scan me. Yes. Very good. Very good use. Look at that. Oh, Fingers are. pointing. Wow. Yeah. Buddies against bully. Oh, yes. That's my favourite so very far. good. Like nice that. One. That's a good one, too. That's a nice one. Like what you've done there. Reach out. They've done that as well. They did Speech Bubble. Nice Be a bully, not a buddy. Um, be a buddy, not a bully, even. <laughs> Very nice good hashtags. Remix. Good remix, like too, it. yeah. Yeah. Good vibe. Oh, Holly and Ellie, that was a page. Well done. I like yeah. that. Good vibes only. I like that a lot. Good stuff. QR code uh, there. That, yeah, that's a good one as well. Nice and simple. Mm -hmm. That's another good page. Mm -hmm. Here's a post. Couldn't work that one. Parents Guide to Bullying. Very good. Wow. Very nice. Good template, that, I think. Um, there we go. There's another one from Lulu. Yes, uh, hero inspired. <laughs> yeah, very good. Lots of uh, good angles on their text there. And then they're back to ones that we've done before. We're so back to ones. Okay. Well done. Really impressive. Yes. Very Don't worry. well done indeed. Yeah. If we didn't get time to show right. everybody's, we will. Here's one that we haven't shown. Swag. Yeah. I think we're gonna uh, just have a look at a couple from schools that we might not have seen before. Uh, there we go, there's one here as well, I think we should look at. Uh, that one's the page, that's cool. Uh, let's try that one as well. God, they're just coming in so fast. Oh, <laughs> okay, I'm exhausted from seeing them all come in so fast. Nice, like. Oh, you see. Yeah, that's very good, very designy. Like right, your background, Zara. Good one, Jacob. You've done a page. Do not bully. Good stuff. Like the text coming in. Good. I like it. Uh, stand up against bullying. Good stuff. Oh, they're almost going Christmas themed there. They're ready yeah, for Yeah, they are going Christmas themed. Yeah. Bully not a buddy. They've always seen that one. Done 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 that one. Okay. Right. Let's go on to our, we've done the web design, we've done the graphic design, you're sharing your work like the legends that you are. Challenge three, video editing. Right, let's Stop do this. Dog. What? Stop hey, let's do dog. this in record. Yeah. <laughs> let's, let's do this in record time. Right. Uh, we're going to use this again. 
Okay, so I'll actually, let me get it on another device really quickly. I always forget to do this. Interesting. There we go. I've got it open now, so we're all good. So what we're going to do is we're going to create a video now. So I'm going to come out of this just by clicking the little button in the top left. And um, our third challenge is to create a video talking about anti-bullying, like the example below. You can look at that in your own time if you need to. Mm. We're going to be using the writing again. Let me drag that in here. Uh, and I'm going to go to the home page. You're going to be using the Adobe Spark video app if you're on an iPad. But here, you're just going to go down to video. Now, these two are so similar, so similar. So I would recommend working alongside us here, I think, because I don't think you need the two. I don't really think you need the two demonstrations. So we'll kind of go through twice quickly. Uh, uh, what do yeah. you think, Nicole? Yeah, yeah, we'll go, we'll go through it and we'll talk a little bit back and forth. Hey, hey, Dom, do you reckon you can pause the duck music? Oh, don't you like it? Uh, I do, but I, pretty poppy. I, I know sometimes I find it hard to concentrate, though, on two things at the same oh, okay. time. All right. There all we right, go. All right. Sorry, it's so just, it might just be me. <laughs> <laughs> actually i'm just going to call mine not bullying and call it anti-bullying okay right now you can use a template if you like but we've actually got a script or i gave you a script so therefore mm -hmm. i'm going to say no so start from scratch okay i'm fed up of doing all my work and you all of you stealing it yeah there you see there you see nicole she and Phil are having so much fun and they love the music <laughs> I mean, talk about anti-bullying week. Don't you think? I think Nicole bullies me sometimes. Not at all. Strong statement there. Strong statement. I'm only messing. Right. So let's go to title and text. Uh, I'm going to put my title is in, which is, how can we stop put, uh, put a stop to bullying in schools? And then I'm going to put my name in. You don't have to put your name in if you don't want to. But I'm going to make sure that my name is smaller than my title. I think that's mm -hmm. important. Uh, I'm using a title and text because I've got the title and my text underneath is my name. But you can use a full screen if you like. The layout's just in this tab here. And then behind it, I'll put a photo. So again, you can just search for something really easy like bullying. Uh, let me see. This one looks good or it looks appropriate at least. And then you can do fancy things like you can... Um, just wait for this spinning wheel of death. I mean, spinning wheel of loading. Uh, you can put your text in the top left, for example, uh, because mm. I kind of feel like it frames things quite nicely. So I'm going to leave it there. And then you can also do things like zoom in and move it around, stuff like that. That one, oh, didn't want to do that. Whatever I did, didn't want to do it. So, like that, and pull it down. Nice. Okay. Nice. And then recording voiceover is dead easy. We click this microphone-y, button-y thing in the middle, and then you just speak. How can we put a stop to bullying in schools by Dom Trainer? There we go. You have to use your best. Uh, you have to use your best TV voice there, like mine. <laughs> and then you can yeah. click the plus there, and you just get another uh, fancy little screen to do your next one. I'll just do one more section, and it's what is bullying in schools. Now, there's a couple of ways you can do this. Uh, you could split screen it. So you could put your question on this side. Now, you could make it really big like that. And if you've got your answer on a different device, then it's quite easy to uh, you know, use your um, voiceover button here and be able to say your text. But Nicole came up with an absolute humdinger of a <laughs> tip, which was... Ah. I, I actually got it from you, so I'm not going to take credit, but it's pasted in. That's not even true. Oh. There we go. It's there not we go. true. Paste it in. It's tap the there. microphone, read the answer, and then delete the answer from your text because it's going to stay there. Like this. Bullying is often defined as behavior that is repeated and hurts someone physically or emotionally. Then go in and like our mistress and lord of all good things said <laughs> we can just delete it and then it's all gone and then on the right hand side you can stick in a photo um mm -hmm. maybe here uh is it gonna play ball come on play ball with us yeah maybe we could get an icon bullying yeah maybe an icon would be cool <gasps> there's all sorts of weird stuff here what's going on don't like that one that's exactly why I'm putting it in. 
Um, something like that. Or, yeah, that one's good. I like that. But you can also change it to an image if you want to as well. And then, yeah, it's not playing ball right now. But anyway, um, Nicole, would you like to show people your magic skills, please? Yeah, so I've been working alongside you, Dom, there. So I have, I've gone for a theme on here. So up, just up at the top here, you've got themes. And you can see I've chosen flair because it's got this black outline around it. And you can... You're, you're a flair player. <laughs> hey, thank you. You can toggle between the different ones there, but I quite like this one. And then I'm going to tap done. And once I've tapped done, you can see this is what I've got so far. And I've got some voice recording in here too. So I've got to hear. I quite like, again, it's very similar to the page where it's swapped over my split screen look. So I'm just going to, my plus button is on the right hand side. So I'm just going to tap plus. And the layout that I want for this one, do you know what? I will go with um, title and text, I think. Um, and I'm going to go get my text over here. So I'm on. Point three and copy. And then go in here. Actually, I changed my mind. Don't want title and text. I just want caption. So I'm going to paste in the big long bit. And again, then just tap the microphone button, read out the answer, delete the answer. Speak up if you hear others bullying your friend. If you don't feel comfortable speaking directly to the bully, talk to an adult at your school. There we go. And now I can go in here, delete this. It just means that you don't need to, one, listen to the rustling of paper while you've written down your answer, or you don't need a second device and another teleprompter app open. You can just do it all in there at the same time. And then I'm going to find an icon for speak is sort of the main word in there. And yeah, there's a couple, so I can pop that in. Yay. Oh, nice. So, yeah. So I'm quite That's partial to the icons whenever, or the shapes, whenever I'm doing the videos in here. Um, also, I think yeah. keep it consistent, whatever way you do it, um, it'll, it'll have a nice look and feel. So when we've got, you can just nice. continue working through the rest of that. But what I want to show you is you've got your music up here. So... In our music, you've got, well, you got to think about the topic. So we're talking about anti-bullying. We're talking about kindness and friendships. Um, so what theme and what genre of music best fits that topic? Is it happy? Is it playful? Is it something more relaxed, perhaps? Um, teachers, there's going, to, there's going to be a lot of noise of people tapping and um, playing some samples of songs. So you can tap mm. it and go, does that work for me? Do, do I like that one? Um, also, top tip, if you're doing your recording and you're in a room, a classroom full of 20, 30 one. people. I was waiting you, for this one. <laughs> if you have it, it's, it's, it it's definitely getting colder, so you probably have your big coat in school, is put the coat on your head and put the back of your coat over the front of you, and you've almost got like a little recording booth in there, and you only need to be under there for what? what's the maximum nine seconds to read a sentence and then come back out for your air. So sometimes it just <laughs> blocks out a little bit of noise in the background. It seems unconventional, seems a little bit weird and kooky, but I promise you it does work. And that comes from a former primary three teacher. So it works with six-year-olds. So it definitely will work with it our digital leaders here. Totally does work. It's a cracking, it's a really good bit, little bit of a tip there. Okay, let me, I'm going to show you, I'm going to sort of do similar stuff to Nicole. I've got a photo on this side. This man is throwing papers up in the air. Like a lunatic, I've recorded my voiceover. I've got slightly jealous of Nicole showing everyone all the cool things like themes and taking over, and you know, showing everyone their skills and all the rest of it. So I'm going to change my theme, and you can also do the remix button. You didn't show them that, did you? I didn't. This didn't is why you that. are the <laughs> Hey, listen, I only. Find and he realized it was there about a week ago. Uh, no, I didn't say that. It wasn't. That's not true. It's not true. Uh, but you can remix things and it gives you a slightly different style. There you go. Give it a darker theme. Actually, green's my favorite color. So maybe I'll go green. Yeah. Okay. And like Nicole did before, I'm going to create like, like this one here, like for my second section, for example. I'm going to go for my layout's going to be caption. And rather than 
um put in all my text what i'm going to do is i'm going to i'm going to do what nicole does we're going to put it in there i'm going to press record i would feel afraid when we feel afraid we feel threatened when we feel unsafe it is exhausting okay and now what i'm going to do is i'm just going to start playing around with this text and i'm just going to do it like a list threatened so you don't have to use all the text uh unsafe exhausting so you know you don't have to uh, read everything or put everything on screen that you want to say mm -hmm. you can just do a little snapshot of it so uh so it could be like exhausted something like that let's see what we get uh there we go that's a good one it may be y'all like, saying the word exhausted. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And then uh, once that's loaded, I can pop that into the top left there. So dead nice. easy. Nicole, have you got any other little tricks up your sleeve that you're just going to spring on me and make me look like I've only just learned how to use this program? <laughs> um, yeah. So <laughs> one of them, one of them that I can show you is resizing. So um, for a while, there was some social media that only allowed you to use Square for posting. So you can change to have, and I didn't need to go in and change my text and everything. It automatically resizes it for me, which I absolutely love. I think that's a pretty cool one that you can resize it in there as well. You don't have to have the widescreen movie version. Um, the other thing that we can do is we can start to share our work. Um, and that's hopefully what some of you Speedy Gonzales digital leaders have already done. Um, so, Gonzales, I love it. Love so it. Tap, tap share. You can save it directly to your camera roll. Again, if you're going to post this up on your digital learning platforms, Seesaw, Google Classroom, Teams, whatever you're using, or onto your school website or onto your school social media, that's where you save it to your device and share it from there. Or copy the link to a clipboard, which means what we can start to do here if I copy this link, and um, because it's a video, it can take a few seconds longer than the other um, creative challenges true, we've true. done. Yeah, um, what I can do, especially when you're live streaming as well. Yeah, what I can do is I can go back into my Adobe page that we started earlier. Uh huh. Nicole. And, yeah, I'm not. What are you? To what are you that. trying to do here? <laughs> I'm going to tap plus here and I'm going to pop in the video. I've already got the link saved to my clipboard. Da, 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 and it will paste we, in there once the once it has generated the public link. So that'll take a wee minute longer again, just because it's images and video and music and audio, my voice recording too. So it'll pop into there. You can also put your graphic in here. So your Adobe page that we started off with today. Why not put in your graphic and put in your video and you've got it all in one place. Nicole, is there any space here for me? Yes, there is now. Tag, you're it. I'll throw it back. What? <laughs> There's nothing left to do. I mean, talk about, oh, honestly, this is just a, it's outrageous. I mean, <laughs> I was going to show you how to how to do your whole video sharing by pressing at the top here and I already pressed well, yours it. yours is different. My link. Yours is and different. Then, Do you have an almost ready link? I don't have an almost ready link. Well, yeah, well, you know, you were too busy showing everyone else the fancy things, weren't you? And then now I've got it. And like Nicole said, right, <laughs> go back into your page. Honestly, where's my page? I'm just sick of this. Every time we do these sessions, everyone's just like, we didn't even need you there. Oh, right. that's not and then true. I'm going to put it in. PG. <laughs> it's a video. Put it at the top there. You see, mine's already published. You see. That's where she had an almost ready link, you see. Yeah, That's where the well, desktop has perks. <laughs> I'll tell you one thing that Nicole didn't tell you is that yeah. now that I've put a video into my page, I need to mm -hmm. press share and publish and share link again because it says, hey, we, we noticed that you, Dom Trainer, not Nicole O'Connor, you, Dom <laughs> Trainer, made some changes to your work. And so you need to update your link. Otherwise, people won't see it. You see, Nicole O'Connor didn't tell you that. So I'm going to I press update my link. And then <laughs> when I share my incredible link with everybody who will listen, then I will go in here, put it in. And unlike Nicole O'Connor's, mine will be all there. 
<laughs> waiting for you to play. All right, all right, all right. Kudos, <laughs> kudos whether whether you do well done, Dom. You smashed. What a it. team! What a team! You. Right. What's the last thing we need to just reiterate here? I think it's probably around sharing. Yeah. So we're gonna. You need to need to share, and you also need to tell your teacher that you have completed at least two of the challenges. You might have even done both of them live with us right now, and you you might have got all three. So if you've done more, then make sure you tell your teacher. Your teacher can email Dom. Don't email me. Dom's in charge of the swag. <laughs> email Dom and he will send you swag for every digital leader who has completed two of our challenges today but if you are a digital leader who's going to take it to the next level and you're going to go into another classroom which I absolutely loved whenever I was teaching I love digital leaders coming in then those those digital leaders are going to become swag legends because Dom will give you enough swag that you will give out to people that you're in the classes that you're going to go into and share this with He's going to be busy. And He's what form of transport is that swag going to arrive in, Nicole? <laughs> I, I think it's going to be a truck. Would we say it's a truck load? Truck. A van load? <laughs> that, sounds like, that sounds like a lot of swag to me. That sounds yeah. like a lot of swag. But yeah, it you do need to do that. I will be sending all of your teachers out a link where they can tell me how many of you completed two out of three. So you might need to do more, some, some more time. That's fine. Do it, do it later on. And you might also... Um, and then you also need to, you know, say, say to your teacher, hey, can I go and teach this in another class? Please, please let me do it. And then um, and then you can you can say that and we will be able to give you even more swag or VIP swag, swag legend, swag legend stuff. And then you can also give stickers out to other people and be like, a... you get a sticker, you get a sticker, you get a sticker. Yeah. <laughs> stickers for all. Woo. Stuff like that. All righty. Well, I think. I think we're probably um, just about done there. I think people can, yeah. if, I think some people will have had to go already, um, which is fine. I mean, I am a little bit sad inside, but it is, um, it is time to pack people, up in fairness. It's pack up time, it really, time in these classrooms. Yeah. <laughs> it is. So the share your work thing is down at the bottom. Um, your teachers need pestering. Excuse me. Um, please could you tell Dom and Nicole that I did two out of three and then also I'm going to teach every single child in the rest of the school that would be good um, and that's kind of Thank it you. really Nicole yeah. as we oh, always do Nicole is going to send us off with a thought for the day yeah, all I want to say is thank you so much for all of the lovely comments this has been definitely the most active chat that we've had in any of the sessions so far so thank you yeah. all so much have a fantastic rest of your anti-bullying week. Peace, love, and hugs from Dom and I. Bye. <laughs> Thank you very much. And good luck with the rest of your work.